There's no place to escape to. This is the last stream. On the left. <laughs> That's when the cannibalism started. Marcus has his Luca K. Luca say it, so he's gonna be just fine. Daddy's got his juice. Daddy's yeah. got his juice. Yeah. Daddy may have taken twice anti the anti-anxiety medications that he usually takes, and he may have done it by accident today. Hey, man. Oh, so that's he that may one. need his Lucozade to keep awake all day. You know what I like though is that that makes you extra relaxed. Super oh, chill. Yeah. I can see it. I mean, to the In point no way where does it have the opposite effect where it just <laughs> makes you want to eat your own face off. <laughs> I actually thought Marcus was so relaxed. His pants were wet with urine. <laughs> Which I actually, relax. I was thinking he's so relaxed. Look Real how relaxed. Tube, his tube is open. Oh, oh yeah. that's great. I, we also want to thank everyone who tuned into the special last stream during the Twitch subathon. Thank you so much. You guys, you guys were wonderful. That was such a great experience. Thank you. And, so good. Uh, it's all coming up on this week. Just so you know, we'll start. We'll start with the plugs. We'll start with start the plugs. With the the plugs. Marcus mandate. So let's before we everybody gets unsettled and leaves. Let's start. To, we'll start with. I the got plugs. some stuff planned. Well, you know what I but learned we got, today. Oh yeah, we got. So we got Twitch. We're coming back to Twitch next week. So we got No Dogs on Monday, Hoopa Goo Goo, and Good Put. It's gonna be on Thursday nights. We're back in Twitch.tv slash Slash Podcast. Ron DeSantis' so his favorite show, Good Put. He just it's three fingers. Of entertainment. <laughs> um, also today on my radio show, you know what I learned? The grossest thing on Fear Factor that was actually cu actually cut. What? The contestants had to play horseshoes, and if you lost, you had to drink twenty four to thirty six ounces of donkey semen mixed with donkey piss. Well, can we get that footage? I actually have the audio. We played it. I'm going to find it for my stream. Can we play? Oh yeah, oh, I would love God. to hear that. I yeah, love the, to hear you that. only have audio. Uh, well, I'm sure there's some video of it. We just played the audio because it was oh, a serious okay, okay, I would love okay. but, um, Is there even just a picture of it that we can find, there? Producers said that it went too far. <laughs> you know, because that, <laughs> why mix it? Well, because usually they say, oh, it's a delicacy. So, like, uh -huh. when you're eating bugs, you're like, well, they eat that they X, eat that. Uh, yeah, X yeah, place. Yeah, so, yeah, you're like, yeah, okay, yeah, you can yeah. Donkey it. piss with donkey cum? Apparently, in no other, no culture. Do people drink donkey piss mixed with donkey cum? What? So the producer said, you know what? This episode, even though the people did have to do the stunt, they did decide to can it. So you're saying that there are cultures where donkey cum is a delicacy, oh, yeah. and there are I cultures where donkey You've piss is a delicacy, but there is no culture dude. where donkey piss plus donkey cum hey, is you a delicacy. You want to be kosher. Dude, you've never had the donkey cum pie at Danino's? <laughs> dude, did you have it? Is this it? <laughs> oh, Mediaites covering it, so it's got to be big. We're going to save it. Yeah, we have yeah, to all right, we'll all right, we'll yeah, save it. We'll save it. All right. Wait a second. What I don't understand is well, you won't you get the but it starts with this picture of a sad donkey. That donkey should actually can, be well, relieved. Put it, put it just it got up here then. It Aaron. just came and then just Well, I mean, come on. You're you're hijacking my man. No, I'm not hijacking. Oh, you're hijacking no, immediately with donkey with donkey. But you got to go 55 miles an hour or otherwise oh, you're going to crash. Oh, you're going to see the rest of it. Sorry, Marcus. I will see the rest of it. I had it in my brain. There we go. We'll show it during my man. It's Marcus's man. Yeah, save it for yourself. I'm sorry. To be frank, I was just curious about the color. Yes, so it's going to be surprisingly white, clear, viscous. So it you're saying, be. so you're saying that the cum greatly overtakes the color the, of the piss. That's what I was thinking because I thought unless, it was more of an orange Julius. Unless, of course, the donkey was originally. He's been working out and he's really hydrated. Yeah. Could be. Could How you be. doing? Ben is the king of VR. That's what Pippa says right here. <laughs> I do remember that. That was extremely funny. Hey that everyone, was extremely I'm fine. Funny. We were talking right before the show. We're like that VR segment made at, at a laugh. That and, like added years to my life. And guys, I didn't get enough thank you for uh, the new sponsor. The, the new sponsor we got after my little flying experiment: uh, adult size helmets. That's yes, nice. indeed. They officially thought I was special needs. <laughs> You do have some special needs, <laughs> but his special needs are all about more so about his cracked mental health. Oh my God! Well, one special need I have is I'm trying to save. I just don't, I'm so sick of spending money, so I've been trying to do new normal Uber. I got into a normal Uber today, and I am not normal. I fucking was folded up in there, and she was so nice. But I was like, I'm gonna take you. She's it's, like, Is the air okay? I'm like, Yeah, it's just all everything else. You're real small in a Ford Focus. You oh, are. It's a Prius. You are. It's too oh. focused of a car. Yeah. You need to expand. Anyway, <laughs> this isn't about me. This is about Marcus's man. You're right. That's right. And I know Ben. Maybe this is a little bit about you. I'm gonna start it with something because I know that you took issue with Richard E. Grant. The guy, yes. the man, yes, I, I know you took issue with him, and there are other people who take issue with his extraordinarily sunny outlook on life, even when he's grieving for his dead wife. Hey, man, you gotta, <laughs> if you ain't laughing, you're crying. Yeah, I guess. So let's see this first video. We're gonna show a video of a man 
who uh, who took issue with it, and I think you're all going to be pleasantly surprised. <laughs> I love this. <laughs> okay. I already like this. I was talking with my tennis teacher about <laughs> aging, and I realized with age comes confidence. For example, a half hour ago, I shit my pants. I have yet Lord. to wipe because I'm confident that eventually it will dry out and cake off. <laughs> oh, love it. love it! It stinks! Uh, He's uh, the best, love, man. You're shit, and I'm champagne. You know, I'm uh, shit. Love it. I'll never forget, I did John Lovitz's comedy club over here way back in the day, yes. and it's floor-to-ceiling pictures of John Lovitz. It's just Both Lovitz. Both sides of the stage, and, and he also. Is. It is another world. Because he also used to, for a while at least, I think when Brad Garrett was slightly guilty of this, but then I've heard Brad, I've heard Brad Garrett's very grumpy. He's yeah, an asshole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Frankly, he's an asshole. But John Lovitz would do, you come to his set, right? You'd come to do his club, and he always closed. Mm -hmm. Like, yeah. no matter what happened, that even if you crush it, and yes, John it's Lovitz. It's floor to ceiling. <laughs> like, he's Kim Jong-un. And he's extremely talented. He's John Lovitz. He's yeah, hilarious, Lovitz. but everybody has... They're bomb nights, and nothing is like watching a frustrated man yell at a berated audience for not understanding him in front of a mural of himself. <laughs> I like love he's it. Musa like he's Mussolini. I love love it. He is absolutely yeah. fantastic. Big Herb. One of my course, favorites. wearing a Florida Gator shirt. Big Herb, That's indeed. Right. Well, good for the old love. I'm happy he's shitting himself, living his best possible life. John Lovitz is also, he's a must follow on social media. He's very, very funny. He is also Phil Hartman. You know, his wife that killed him, my mother's friend, went to school with her because she's from North Dakota. Really? Mm -hmm. Why and, didn't she do anything? Well, because <laughs> they didn't know she went off to Hollywood. She was a big timer now. No, not the really. The cows didn't talk in North Dakota and say, be careful, Phil. She's crazy. Um, but John Lovitz beat the fuck out of Andy Dick because Andy yes. Dick was the one who got Lovitz's wife back on the smack. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Well, now I can see John Lovitz beat up Andy Dick. Oh, yes. I would love to see that. And then Andy Dick end up weirdly in that man's trailer. Oh, and then sweet. he was sucking that other man's dick for wine. And then uh, he was on a bunch of live streams on Twitch. Yeah, that's true. He was basically <laughs> held like kidnapped, but also it's Andy Dick and you're an adult. So you're like, just go. But then. Uh, that's weird. Well, you know, if you if you want to know where Andy Dick deserves to be where? for all the things that he's done, let's see. Oh, right, let's check it out. In the White House? <laughs> <laughs> Political <laughs> satire. He deserves to be with the trash monkey. Yeah, put him with the trash wow, monkey. Wow, what a perfect trash mountain. Incredible. Oh, what are these oh, monkeys They're all do? baboons. This is great. This is like the goodwill for them. That's so fun! Isn't that incredible? I feel like it's nice because, again, if those are like a bunch of kids, everybody would be all sad. Well, you know what, <laughs> right? though? Because they're looking for food, looking for shelter, and amongst all the garbage, yeah. they, you know, the plutonium mines or well, whatever. Yeah, yeah. But because they're monkeys, it's cute. It's cute. Yeah. But also, you remember kids. I mean, we used to, back before, oh. it would, back when your kids would be kids, we used to just go find any pit, any hole, any construction site. The, That's a playground now. The dump. How many times have I told you guys about great times at the dump that I you had when I was a kid? Heard. I love the dump. Heard. It's actually love the newest the podcast dump. coming to the last podcast network is... Love the dump. Uh, love the dump. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Shane Byrne says, where'd they get the video of chat? <laughs> <laughs> love the dump. See, I was thinking about the other day, because I was watching this, you know, a house get knocked down, right? You know, it's this bad story. Something bad happened there. Yeah. Everybody lost everything. Yeah. You know, they're knocking yeah, yeah. it down. They turned that to the Idaho house where that guy killed all those people. I, as, I mean, it's hard to resell that unless you are going to sell it to me, right? <sighs> because, but it's, again, it's hard to find somebody like me who then will have someone who will stay with them in a loving marriage it's, in order to purchase that house. It's yeah. still within the college community. I think it was best they tore that one down. I think you're correct. Have um, you guys seen that murder at Middle Beach? That's on uh, HBO. It's this like four episode doc. It's pretty good. It's a true crime doc. It's a guy trying to solve his mother's murder. Yeah, mother. I just never watched it. Yeah, it's good. It's, it's good. You'd like it. But he keeps going back to the house where his mother was murdered. And there's still people living there. And he keeps asking them to like go through the house <laughs> and like d reenact the murder and drag <laughs> these big bags, 160 pounds, like across the All right, yard. now my mom's oh, tits were like that's about a C. And that's like, <laughs> like honestly, the way Wait, mm, that's like a couple of grapefruits. So let's yeah. actually staple a couple of grapefruits to this. Snap, 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 <laughs> snap right through the tent. Right. Meanwhile, like they're all trying to watch, uh, you know, who wants Dora, to be a millionaire? Explorer, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> who wants to marry a multimillionaire? That guy yeah. uh, in 2000, he was also abusive to other women, and then really? she had to marry that guy. I also this is all want... stuff you you just learned. I know, I'm this. just learning. Yeah. You just learned all this. I learned and I share. But yeah. I was gonna say before, I remember being a kid 
the, the most incredible thing in the world was just an open field. Because mm -hmm. you know that's where you'd play ball and you'd beat all mm. the kids and get out there. Oh, and yeah. now Lipstick I see ball. an open field and all I think of is like five people on their knees getting shot in the head execution style. Well, <laughs> Reservoir Dogs. Well, you grew up in Queens. Wasn't Queen Marcus shot at, Ginny asks? Uh, yeah. They, an old lady shot at me and my buddy Dusty when we were in her trash heap. Cause she Ooh, had a big. That was her trash. In her yeah. trash. That's my trash. Those yeah. are my cans. Yeah. There's, well, there was this big, like you, like kind of UPS type box truck back there that we loved to like fuck around with, and yeah. there's just all this weird metal stuff with all these big jagged edges everywhere. Mm, right. And yeah, she peppered us. Hey, well, you know that's yeah. technically. So, uh, you know how many she people I've heard that. You know, drunk junk's money. Like if you find out if you went out to this, that's her money. She was a hoarder. That's, that's her she junk. She was a hoarder. Yeah, yeah. That that's her sense. life. Yeah. that's her family. Then no, that it's was... even worse than her money. It's her family. Such yeah. a fine line between being a collector and a hoarder. Oh, it's, I don't really uh, know where well, it's blurry. It's if you um, it's have to. Uh, it's if you have to pull shit out of your butt with your tissue and then put it into a place because you have jammed too many newspapers into your toilet. That's when it, you're in a hoarder place. If multiple animals have gone missing inside oh, of your home, yeah. then oh, you're in a hoarder what was that place. Last episode Marcus just episodes collects ago? records. Yeah, and that's fine. He doesn't hoard oh, records. No. You know what else I learned today? I learned this on the radio because I was stuck in traffic. Do you know how many... <laughs> do you know how many vinyl press... Um, These are like the letters Records, my grandfather LPs, used to send companies. to me, where he's just Do like, here's another factoid I saw in the U.S. <laughs> news, and it was just all just, uh, maybe you're gonna like this one. Do you know how many vinyl pressing, like, companies there are? Three. No, there's a hundred total, most of those are small, and there's only ten worldwide. Wait a second, so you just, you just said that there were a hundred. Yes, and then but those are said, small, and uh -huh. then the big ones, if you're a real big band, like Ben Folds 5 or Megadeth. Right. Big band. Uh, then you have to do that. You oh, everyone's buying Top his new CDs or his albums, and there's ten of those that you can Yeah, everybody's, ten of those. everybody's talking about Ben Folds 5. Yeah. Everybody is. Everybody's, uh, everyone, Everybody who's Everyone's anybody. asking for that repress of whatever and ever amen. Yeah, everyone's I would. asking for it. I would. You know what? Yeah, if there's a song for 2023, it's Brick. <laughs> Absolutely, because if anything, uh, more like this election's gonna be an abortion. <laughs> Satire. We're more really... like the president. You know what? Uh, Marcus well, what lived in Fraggle Rock, according to Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was a very, very sad town. Very sad town. Yeah. And you know what those Snaggle people? Rock. You know what those people mm. needed? <laughs> they needed. They needed a treat. <laughs> they needed to treat themselves. Yeah, you need to treat yourself. You I've been saying that. And myself. we just and you know we we worked pretty hard this weekend on the subathon. Our employees did a wonderful they job. Did. All they they, I made all y'all killed it. Honestly, everybody killed it. And I'm almost tears so the clown. By the way, I think tears stole the oh, yeah. show. Tears oh. stole the show. And they're Absolutely. almost paid enough. They're almost paid enough. But almost. I'm hoping it's good that on Monday. They treated themselves. I bet. I bet. I bet. Hope against hope. I'm you hoping Uncle Eddie hanging out and, and make sure to get something real nice for yourself. Yeah, I, I'm hoping they treated themselves, and I can only hope that they treated themselves just like Garfield treats himself. Ooh, okay. Ooh, what is right. this? It looks spicy. Are they putting flaming hot in the ice cream now? Because I love flaming hot, but you know, so. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> He's on extra anxiety meds today. <laughs> extra anxiety meds? <laughs> I feel like I need extra anxiety <laughs> Well, how do you even eat it out of costume? I really did think there would be more. I, I definitely thought there was going to be more. Be more. <laughs> Nothing Let's rewatch it. No, you can't. You didn't even eat it. I wanted to decide There was this nothing is, to it. Is it flaming hot? Nothing happened in it. But is it, it flaming hot? No, oh, we just looked at ice cream. <laughs> It's not even, there's no oh. bit. <laughs> oh, I see the fingers is kind of funny. Yeah. Yeah, could go for the continuation of it here. <laughs> there's no bit. There's no, no he point. Liked that, Marcus liked that he did that. Yes. I like that he did that. And this. he liked that he did that. Like yeah. <laughs> and if you look, let's watch it one more time. Let's watch it one more time. You'll see that the cup changes. See? See, there it is. It's just got him eating lasagna. Yeah, I see. I don't want to think about lasagna when I'm no. eating ice cream. Right. No. It says treat yourself now. It's the other no, side. No, it doesn't. Treat yourself yeah, now. The cup doesn't change. They just switch it around to treat the other side. Treat yourself now. Now that I look at it, I do see the corner of, las of the lasagna pan. Yeah, just saying, yeah, big, just, big herb. Thing. Is that supposed to be lasagna flavor? I think so. Uh, I think that's what they're intimating. Yeah, I think You know are, what, yeah. dude? I, I, you know, sometimes I complain, but whatever. I'm not going to complain about this flaming hot trend. You were been you had flaming hot popcorn. Fine. Have you had it? No, it's good. It's good. Got pipe, flame, flame, 
Flaming pop popcorn is <laughs> so good. Yeah, yeah. Also, you know what's good? Crunch it up. Truly. All right. Don't come at me for this because this is this is a real actual. So far, so good. I, I like dessert, it. Crunch right? it up. Take a get a couple of chicken breasts. Mm -hmm. Pound them out. Oh, yeah. Pound mm -hmm. them out. Then you you want to salt and pepper those chicken breasts. Mm -hmm. Get some mayonnaise. Okay. Mean this mayonnaise. Oh, mayonnaise. Okay. Okay. mayonnaise. So again, salt and pepper, and then flaming hot popcorn. That stuff. You mash it up with flaming hot popcorn yeah. with corn flakes. You oh. cover it in the chicken and you fry that shit. You okay. are a real you, chef. That's called fucking fat ass. Shit. Yeah. That's a great sand. The fat That's ass good, shit. Dude. No, yeah. man, that is and good, dude. Take... You ever had that? You've never done that? You never used no, spicy I don't Cheetos? No, absolutely not. You never use spicy Cheetos? You never use spicy Cheetos when you make a chicken? Do you know how many times I go for <laughs> burgering them out? Because sometimes it's nice to have a different like, corn like texture on the outside of a chicken. Yeah. Yep. That's nice. I was eating spicy. I was eating the popcorn and I scratched, I touched my eye and it burned. That does happen. That's an old man injury. Yeah, yes, indeed it was. I've done that same thing and with other body parts. Probably. Well, I, your the cock, worst part. Yeah, no, I've done it on my penis. I've done it yeah. on my penis. I've actually it's had in that. the head. Well, yeah. no, nothing's like you going and do do like the ball scratch. But nothing like trying to be intimate with your partner, mm. and you go to you have been cutting jalapenos, <sighs> and then you go to unfurl. Yourself. Well, you yourself really do need as, to just... as you go to mount this lucky married woman yeah so, but there is the and then you understand oh now my penis is wildly burning mm -hmm. and well, then but i you know and then about her and I mean, then you've missed your window for the month yeah yeah the hump window it's a five minute hump window every month henry gets one <laughs> and, and isn't that nice um but you got it what the, so the moment struck when you were smelling jalapenos you, <laughs> oh we need to have sex right now and and so fast you couldn't wash your hands i lost use of my penis I lost use of my penis because of my attitude. The government said I couldn't have it anymore. Shut Joe Biden shot. came over my house and he said, Listen here, Jack, can't use that penis no more. I was like, call Mr. Biden. Let me see that body. And we fucking had sex with each other. That is one hell of a satire. white person recipe. Only salt and pepper. Fuck you, Frank. What well, do so you know? Mayonnaise. And what that's the fuck literally. You? That's oh, fucking. God. That's completely oh, God, too many one of us. You, you fuck you, you fucking ass. Fuck your fucking ass. Flaming hot popcorn. Coming at me. Mayonnaise. I lost salt the, and pepper. I legally chicken. lost the use of my penis. <laughs> you fucking bitch. Wow. Up next, we've got a new segment that I'm wow. introducing to the oh. stream. I have sex with Natalie way more than once a month. That's <laughs> nice. Okay, good. Yeah, how often does she have sex with you? <laughs> <laughs> is that philosophical? That is, I think it's more of a... An she's emotion. there. It's an emotional question, yeah. Yeah, she's there. She's in body. Yeah. Yes, indeed. Philosophical. It's a great name for a therapist. I suppose so. I would this leave. is a new segment that I'm introducing to the show. Great. It's called, Which One Do You Like? the most oh okay. i'm gonna show you three videos okay and you're gonna tell me and we're also gonna pull the audience too to see which video do you like the most do you want do you want to hear one more funny joke uh, give it what did the carbonated orange juice uh why did the carbonated why did the carbonated orange juice go to the therapist um because it was soda pressed <laughs> couldn't you just say why did the pepsi go or no Carbonated no. orange juice. It was soda. It could just be soda. Why did the Pepsi go to the? To, you could just say why did Pepsi? Oh, because it, but it's but it's orange juice, so it has to be pressed. But it's still soda. You morons <laughs> will get it one day. You know, hey, I'm always learning and I'm always catching up. Always yes, learning. Indeed. Let's now start it up. This it. first video. Which one do you like the most? <laughs> Scary. Oh, it reminds me of college. <laughs> like we're about to watch a gay porn or something dies. Okay. Ugh, God, not this one. Okay, these are bees. Yeah, all right. Oh, I'm Australia. not worked out. I'm not remotely creeped out by this. These what video game? Th this reminds me of a video game. I'm blanking. Last of Us. Last of Us. That's probably what you're thinking. Mycelium. Uh, was it? Mycelium makes him kiss. All right. All right. Okay, that's fine. That's, that's, that's so bad. All right. That's bees. Yeah, bees. All right. That doesn't, that doesn't a book, a stream Let's move on to number two. Which one do you like the most? I'm trying to think. I think it's Doom. It's gonna be Doom. Doom. It's a shooter. I might just be thinking of Resident Evil. I love all these depressed people from Stockford. Oh, God. I don't like this. This I don't This like. is not a contender, you no. think? I do not like this. 
Please vote. It's what I like the least or most. It's which one do you like the most? What so is, is that, that its penis or is that an invasive species? It's a, it's, it's a dead. Bug. It's a it's, it's a, dead. a bug going into the crack cavity of a dead animal. You know, and that's the thing. Is it going in or is it coming out? I don't know. I think it's actually hanging out. This is the new this is the new blue or gold dress. I think question, it's right? doing exactly what it wanted it to be doing in the first place. And just yeah. I dislike. <sighs> What, is that the larvae? Is that larvae in there? Oh, it's out. It's, it's actually oh, it's out. out. It's kind of looked like a poop. Out. Kind of looked like a did. poop. It did. A little bit. Yeah. 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 I mean, that's yeah. nature. Chat did not like the second video. <laughs> no, the Chad first video not, so not Chad, so bad. So chat's yeah. not, so chat's not. No, 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 no. I don't like the second video as well. You know, so I don't like of, it. So out of the two, which one do you like the most? Number one. Number one. Number one. Because number one. Again, it's bees. It's bees it's are bees. extremely important to our environment. Sure. The bees are dying in mysterious ways. Don't, don't forget what they did the to Macaulay Culkin, though. In that one. He deserved it. What was the name of that He could have gone anywhere girl. else. It was my girl. You know what? My girl. Fuck Macaulay Culkin and my girl. Yeah. He could have gone anywhere. He went where the bees were. He could have went. He could have left. They knew the bees were there earlier. That's why they, they were telling him to avoid the area. He had to bang Topanga. Wasn't yeah, Topanga? man. He should have figured Topanga, that. No. He could have done that inside. No. And he was, was 11. It was the, the woman who she he grew couldn't up to come in yet. Veep. In Veep. Yeah. I always get those he two can't. confused. Anna Schlumsky. Now, he can't come. When did you, Well, I started to come when I was like five. Yeah. That's... Dream cheese. My penis went inside out. Okay. Really All right. Okay. Well, so, okay. That's number two. So, now we're going to do three of three. This is number three. Which do you like the most? I'm, I'm feeling, feeling so is... depressed. Let's it's see cold. here. Cold. Every morning. So every fucking morning. morning. Why does another day have to come? Why? Because <laughs> you got you're on contract. Oh, you fucking piece of shit! I was you know I had so much swimmers here. This is actually gonna make me feel. Yeah! Good. I actually, I actually, I don't mind it because he feels so. I know he feels good. <laughs> you know what? I had swimmers. Remember that when I, first, when I was like, I'm gonna go be a pool everybody's boy. Everybody's doing it. I actually uh, feel uh, great relief from that video. You do? Because you well, can just sit out. <laughs> Yeah. And then when it leaves, I, I actually don't, I'm happy for him. You're happy for, I'm happy for, of course I'm happy for him. I'm not sad for him at all. I just want to live any sort of life that doesn't lead to that. But all it took was just two little drops. Yeah. <laughs> After the, the extended evening of dealing with the, <laughs> oh, wondering what the hell worst. is in my fucking ear. What is Meanwhile, that? like, oh, I, I actually, the, oh. All right. When I had my ear infection, I went to the doctor and said, what do you see? He says, just a lot of pus. I was like, yeah. oh, God. See, yeah. pus, I feel... It, it still makes noises, though. It was, yeah, it makes gooshy oh, noises. I, I, that it was the worst. Noises. Yeah, yeah, you got like... You, then you have like Sasha Gray ear. Mm. It's the... Uh, Sasha Gray ear? When it's like... You, you can hear... cauliflower ear? Cockaflower ear? <laughs> <laughs> well, she's doing great. Well, see, because she's got juicy... When she's having sex professionally. That was many moons ago when she pretended to be a dog. That was when she, that was when she, that was her skill. Yes, what was she her, was incredible at it. At, at getting fucked in the ear? I'm, no, no, I'm just. he's trying to make it sound like it's her vagina. I'm just saying. Or her vagina. I just. She was very loud. Yes. Yeah, she was very, <laughs> she won, that's why she won all the AVN awards. She was very good. Yeah, also, she I was very good. the guy that does the porn stuff at the bar that I go to. Holy hell. All I right. watched a little bit. So. Which do you like the most? <laughs> Let's see. Vote. The one. first one. One. That would the be the beast. Is this for the audience? The first the audience this, is, vote? this is for the audience. Yeah. Wow. Number oh, two. Oh, look at this. Look at us. Number two. Interact that would be the worm. Number three. That would be the spider. It's number one. So do you like the bees, the worm, it's or the spider? I Everyone like number is three. choosing number one. I like There's number three the best. No do you way. like number three? I truly do. I don't like bees. I don't like... It gives me that thing. I forget what it's called when you see all this, the squares and the hexagons. Uh, number two, truly. Obviously not number two. Obviously not. But number three, he feels good. The spider also... We like spiders here. You like spi I I'm love, a spider? I'm a spider fan. I fucking ear. Well, again, but I like spiders. Everywhere but inside of my cranium. I agree, but also <laughs> I want it's them to be cute. anywhere else. Right. I I actually am the person because Natalie's deeply scared of spiders. Mm -hmm. I I peacefully remove them from the home because I don't believe in killing them. But right. that spider was kind of cute because he was just like, no, okay, I'll go. He's like, you shouldn't be in there. All right. So what is the uh, Earl to send people to the uh, the the yeah, vote? What's that Earl? What's at? Earl? It's vote. What's on, it's vote. Bitly. W W W L C. 
bit.ly slash L-S-O-T-L. What are you call, are call, calling from a landline? Bitly. Kind of Vote. Talkie? Which one do you like the most? We'll there? check back in <laughs> later on in the show for the results of that poll. We don't Vote have three. to. It's number one. Right. It's for three. certain going to be number one. There's no way it's going to be any. It's not the I'm, spider in some way. I'm willing to bet be we're going to. I think we're going to be pleasantly surprised. I think we're going to be pleasantly Sounds surprised. Like you here. have this whole thing rigged. But yeah, yeah, but at the same time, I don't. I have no skin in this game. Oh, right. I don't care which one All right. wins. All right, so let's cleanse the palate here. You know, we we saw some stuff that might have made you feel a little bit icky, but it's still made you think. It's nature, though, and nature, nature is beautiful. Man, so let's see. Have Whoever you said that's a fucking liar. Have you ever seen Swamp Mistress? No, I've been watching Swamp Mysteries with Troy Landry. Wait, yeah. Swamp Mysteries? It's called Swamp Mysteries with What's Troy mystery? Landry. Troy Landry. There, there What's the mystery? One. I actually have no idea why it's, it's called. The old, did the old farm they hand They let a again? man who cannot speak have a television show. Okay. And the whole thing is, it's all subtitles. He'll be like, you got we all get them out now in the cage and we're not. We are now, now, you will find a big old gator now. And so we're going to be careful now, go to the next. What's this the man, the next, they come in here and they all become the number one put on there. They're hot now, gator now. And then he was about a man hunting snakes that are hunting gators. And they <laughs> went in and it was, he would love this. You would really like it. And wild man, Dusty Crumb, he comes in, <laughs> no shoes, no problems. He's stealing snakes and shit. But he's got a don't tread on me tattoo. You know what I mean? Immediately. Right over he's, his a snake. Head, yeah. he's the only person that should be MAGA who is a snake hunter from Florida. I understand. That's yeah. wonderful. But you should, you could, honestly, that's why I was watching a lot of these animal videos recently. You should get into it because Swamp mysteries. you got to be it. careful with going down there. No. Go down I don't go swamp. down there. Oh, yeah. I learned that from uh, Hatchet, dude. I don't fuck with the swamps. Did you guys do the New Orleans swamp tour? No, no, We not haven't yet. done that. We should, at some point, we should really all do For my birthday, my 40th. You want to do it? Do it? But for my birthday in New Orleans, I'm literally setting up us to have. Okay. A private ghost swamp tour. Okay, I, that would be, I would love to do it with you guys and a group of friends. We need Eddie. Oh no, he has to. We be need there to bring our biggest he's our, friends. He's our our swamp representative. All right, so we're gonna come. We're gonna close come. out the vote. Come. Oh my god! By the we're way, I fucking heard that song on the radio. I know, I heard come. it. Come, <laughs> and I'm just like, I ruined it. You ruined it. Just come, you ruined it yeah. because come. it's C O M E. It's C O M E, <laughs> and all I hear is come. And as you are, like it it'll never not be the sound back. It's a it'll hard, never not. It's a hard come <laughs> every time. It'll never not be. Um, so we're gonna get the uh, results of the poll after this video. But yeah, we saw the ugly side of nature. Now let's see the beautiful side of nature. And let's see this a tour with two of our favorite people, Oprah and Steven Tyler. I can't get enough already. Out <laughs> in nature. I can't get enough already. Dream on. Steven Tyler showing Oprah Woo. his favorite little bit of nature. Dude looks like a lady. I love Steven. I heard something and I was first scared by it. Uh -huh. And then like like back in there, it was so quiet. Uh-huh. And I was so alone Back now. Why are they yeah. This is what I love. There's this is what I love. Look, this like is beauty to me. Okay. A moss. I love Oprah. It's a yeah. compliment to be dressed like Oprah. Okay. It's not too far. Okay. Just a little bit. Into the woods. Mm -hmm. With Steven Tyler. Ah! <laughs> Tyler PJs. <laughs> Steven Tyler PJs. It's the stillness. Yeah, it's the stillness. It's the stillness. It's the woods. It's just, you guys are in woods. <laughs> Look, Steven Tyler's that? taking me to his magical space. He's Look at that. <laughs> it's woods. Oh my God. Right? This. Yeah. And it's, it's just, it's a what, what doesn't live down in here? Yeah. yeah. You. Right? Yeah. But you see, look, there's a whole city in there. Yeah. Full. There's a whole village right I here. Like, I don't like I don't like anyone, anyone anymore. We We've got seen, to leave Los Angeles before we become that. We I know I'm dressing like Oprah, you. No, but I can also go to the woods correct. and not be like, what's that? We literally woods. can't let that happen to us. <laughs> we can't go out oh. to a place and be like, huh, moss. <laughs> It's like a carpet you get at CB2, Whoa. but do, it's here. I do that every time I come around, Moss. You're to, you're a nature yeah, boy. But yeah. It's not you're not pretending like they they just they Christopher okay. Columbus did. How did this you're monster like, no father one else has ever Tyler. seen this? I guess Satan's a little helper. How did this monster father live Tyler? It's actually very easy. All you gotta do yeah. is <laughs> Indeed. Also, he is. God, have you ever seen BB Buell? My God. He's yeah. all, by all accounts, he's a very nice gentleman, and Liv Tyler, beautiful. Empire oh yeah. The, the, the fact that he let his daughter strip in those music videos allowed me to be horny for so long, and that for that, that was I was just thank the two him. one when she was underage. The two of them where he, but I love them though. She wasn't underage. She was I like think she was. No, I think that. She, no, nah, she no, legal. you're crazy. Oh, uh, she legal. You're, you're, Hollywood. 
underage people dressing skimpy? No. You're crazy. You're That's what crazy. I was doing, but that was just because I was trying to make it on the New York Mets. Yeah, <laughs> we know that. But, so, can I ask, why? <laughs> what were they doing? They're just like a part of the Oprah what? show. Why were they holding hands? From what no. I could tell, it's Steven Tyler taking Oprah to his nature spot. I think yeah, that maybe what, that's yeah, on. Yeah, that's exactly what happened. Yeah, I think it's on Steven Tyler's estate. So he wow, just takes, detective. That's did. literally what they said they were doing. <laughs> oh, I didn't from what well, I, I could know, deduce. I thought Henry wasn't paying attention because he asked the question. He asked, what were they doing? And I told him. Oh, he, Steven Tyler adopted a 12-year-old to have sex with. He's not nice. Well, at least he adopted her. Come on. All right. Yeah, I yeah, don't know. I haven't the done the street. blind items for throw, every throw single throw fucking musician. Yeah, yeah. 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 What are you going to do? Jeez oh, um, Louise. But no, I guess that was his. Oh, yeah. He did say it was his. But he has plenty of spots. Couldn't they have a place with a chair? Buddy, that's just where they don't do the blood sacrifices so they can show us the camera where they can show us and be like, see, it's just nothing but good old greenery. You just get, a couple you, of steps away from human skulls being burned. You getting Q on us? Nah, Q? Nah, nah, you getting nah, Q? Nah. Oh, but he's you don't right think about that Steven Oprah. Tyler does He's correct sacrifices. about it. If there was one person who does it, it is Oprah. And <laughs> Steven Tyler, he did bring, remember that was the last Joe Rogan I watched where he brought his own gems. <laughs> To the Joe Rogan, and he pulled, he shot down. He's like, good Joe, interview. I gotta tell you, man, I don't go anywhere without these gems. And I was just like, I, this man, cannot be allowed yeah. anywhere. Like, That's this right. Man except be, he is too financially responsible. He can not allowed anywhere except his special place in the forest. Yes, indeed. Also, and the front man embarrassment. You yeah. know, the reporter who discredited pizza, Comet Pizza, which is not that's not for pedophiles, uh, but he was busted for pedophilia. Wow. Yeah. Well, so you. One in ten, even a broken clock. One time out of ten. It's twelve I numbers. I don't think they accuse the. I think it's just a coincidence. Benfo Wars, <laughs> according to Chad. Benfo Wars. Benfo Wars. <laughs> Fogs, is cheese making you fat, or is it the lack of cheese making you skinny, Fogs? I got some tactical uh, queso. Uh, if you want to buy that, it's great. Rub it all over your feet. You need to listen to more of the, your terrestrial radio more because they give you fun facts. Yeah, they really uh, that's do. That's why I got the fact about the record store. I like about, that. You I see, like that's fun wholesome facts. Fact. Yeah. That was from the Greg B. Herald show. That's not bad. Let's see what another video. Bad. Who's Greg B. Herald? He's not funny. Oh, the results oh, of the results poll. Oh, the, the results of the poll. Yeah, I thought we were getting to this at the end, but... Uh, I like video you one. Won the, the most. That was, okay, but, very good. But it is interesting. Look at how wow. two and three, because that's I knew video one was gonna went out, but I was really interested in how two and three people are just shook disgusting out. to think that three is not is less enjoyable than two. Uh, it's not necessarily. It's what they enjoy. It's subjective. How many people even? One hundred and seventy. Yeah, yep. seventy one, sixty two. Well, because yeah, well, I but guess we all we are gonna wait for the mail in ballots. <laughs> yeah, 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 so, yeah. Hang and chat. I'm actually gonna push. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm gonna hold off on that. That might be a fraud. That All might right. be fraudulent. All right. All right. We'll wait until the end of the episode and get the definitive results. That's the right. final results. Well, let's see another video. That's why we're here. Name of the game. <laughs> Spaghetti. What? One more time. He fucking said it wrong. One more time. Spaghetti. He fucking said it right. He said it's <laughs> I gotta be more strong. <laughs> Was that supposed to be in English? <laughs> no, it's just a funny Voivio thing. This man is filled with what? Lexapro? What is it? He's what did you sucked. take? Did you take it? I took this it? video days ago. But yeah, he's so hopped up. Spaghetti. Well, that is not right. Well, now people are going to be learning the. Can oh. I have the spaghetti? People are going to think they're aliens. Chat's about to. Do, they're trying to stop the steal for the vote. They're Thank saying, you. Hashtag Please stop, stop the steal. steal. Hashtag Thank stop God, the steal. No, Video no, number you three. You got to get in there. You got it. Someone's got to show up and stop this. Everyone got thought. Vi oh, of course, video number one. He was set by the establishment to win. We're in but the let's valley. Let's not forget. We're video in the number valley. Three. You have to come it's here. Your... You have to arrive. You got to stop. You got to stop. Video number us. three. What didn't video number one do? They didn't eradicate or evacuate the bees. Whoa, video hey. three. They evacuated the problem. They Henry, solved the crisis. Henry, if you go to the right swamp tour, you can feed a new tree a dum dum sucker. Hmm. That's oh, so, awesome. You're the bribe so guy? That might be healing for me. I w honestly, it would I be nice that. to complete the circle. Yeah, complete the circle. You know what actually would complete the circle is if you 
jerked one off. <laughs> yeah. I wish that I honestly do wish we could find we could just find I wish it was like animal like I wish it was like a bat like I wish you could have some kind of vengeance with COVID like I wish it was like mm. a little like we're like that's the COVID bug and then yeah you, you could kill stop it stop yeah. a bunch out but yeah yeah I don't need I, we don't need you going out killing a bunch of bats no no we don't, we don't, need, don't, we don't need you doing that don't kill these bats they yeah. don't know they, Wano. Didn't, they didn't know they were sick they mm -hmm. just thought it was allergies, like the rest of yeah. us. Yeah. Oh. In fact, they probably what, they was already dead. I bet. I think about it. It's just ugh, God. I wonder uh, what pangolin tastes like. Hmm. Made in a lab. Made in a lab. I pangolin. actually would love to. I pangolin would, like, probably, honestly, is probably because they do it's obviously. It's an they, isopod, isn't it? Kind a of pangolin? like an isopod. No, a pangolin's no, like an it's, got, it's got the it's got a shell. No, a pangolin's like an aardvark. But it's got a shell. Slash, uh, oh. what's his butt? Like a pangolin's got a shell. What's his butt? Armadillo. Yeah. It's like a goddamn armadillo. It's got the a shell. Bark. That was the name <laughs> the of thing about armadillos is you can get E. coli from touching them and licking Do them. not fuck with an armadillo. No, you no. can also get leprosy so Yeah, from the an pangolin, armadillo. yeah, well, it looks like a little lepro dinosaur. Leprosy is on an all-time rise and in northern Florida. It southern, is. central Florida. I believe yes. it was northern. That's the article I read. I read one that said central I read Florida. it was in northern Florida. Uh, Rob is actually, they, they, they've been going through, so they say the spider has just northern. been indicted. What's that? The spider has just been indicted. Good. That's gonna Someone will up finally up see some justice. Deep state. In. Someone will finally <laughs> see some justice. Um, <laughs> but yeah. Anyway, if you if you do have the ability not to get leprosy, don't don't. Yeah, yeah. It's not supposed to be bad because that's the we other thing. Too. in the '80s, and now everyone's just like, it's cool. I mean, again. it's been around. Well, because we still don't know what causes leprosy. We still know very little about well, it. Bad cool. luck. Being super Shitty cool. attitude. Yeah, we think it. Maybe it's spitting in other people's mouths. It might be. It I mean, I wouldn't. Way. I definitely wouldn't be French kissing a person with leprosy. No, unfortunately, well, that's not they're the lonely. Jesus Herbert Christ of you is it? Yeah, well, then Jesus <laughs> Herbert Christ would have died of fucking leprosy, and I would have laughed. Yeah. I would have fucking laughed. Well, we've laughed a lot. This episode. That's all I do. We've laughed a lot. <laughs> Natalie, but, Natalie, I do that all the time. You guys talk about that, but Natalie, she, oh, it's like people must say to you, Natalie, you must laugh, laugh. All, laugh. all day uh, long. All day long. It's yeah. Nothing more fun than hanging out with a comedian. You oh. must laugh. Also, has got a lot of responsibility. All day which is exactly long. Exactly what comedians now. are good at. You oh. know how great we are at handling really responsibility good and really and stress. Issues and stress and stress. Yeah. In no way do we compensate by either oversleeping, undersleeping, drinking too much, drinking too little, not eating, overeating. We're just so those are yours. Yeah. So we've laughed a lot. So I'm thinking war. What is it good for? Exactly. Absolutely nothing. Oh, a lot of stuff. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's good for a lot of movies. Monetary. Oppenheimer is doing great. It is. It Barbenheimer. Mm hmm. But war. If you go to him the same day, you it's call it the skull doing a Barbenheimer. It's called doing a Barbenheimer. It's called Barbenheimer. It's called one's about a doll and one's about a bomb that killed 100,000 people. Different. It's so wild. Yeah, it's, it's, different. Wild. It's, it's real wild. So wild. I can. It's a wild time to be alive. But war. <laughs> How do we stop it? That's Why? the big question. How do we? And that you was go, one of the central questions of the Manhattan Project. How do we stop war? Right, it was so peaceful. I, so you know peaceful. what? I think every day I wake up, first thought, war, war, war. How do we do not do this? How, how do, do we? Not, how do, do we avoid it? And I wake who up. do we? And that's the thing. If we ask, how do we avoid yeah. it? Our next question must be, who do we turn to? We do. Yeah. do we need to actually do war on war we need to mm -hmm. it's, an, a, it's war. a war on war a we war on war great against war great God, wilco you're so song. unbelievably accurate to everything it's, it's yeah, so zachary accurate. says armadillos are susceptible to leprosy because of their low body temperature interesting war on war great wilco song Vote number it's a three. great wilco song and but that's the thing they didn't solve war with also, that. Wil but Wilco solved nothing except how to sell many, many IPAs across the country. <laughs> you know what? I, I always get confused with Wilco. I like Wilco. I love Wilco. Yes, because I was told. I asked Danny Tamborelli from Pete and Pete, Little Pete. We were at a bar after Danny we and Mike, show. the podcast. Danny and Mike, of course. Yeah. And I was like, Wilco sucks. But I thought it was because it was head, headed by that one guy who's the vegan. The guy who's real mean. Ryan Adams? No, Ryan Adams. Morrissey. Um, but it's Did you not. confused Wilco with the Smiths? I yep. go. And then I said, I, I said, go. Danny, do I like Morrissey? <laughs> I do I like Wilco? And Danny said, Yeah, we like Wilco. I said, I like Wilco. But Morrissey <laughs> just came out and he said, Yeah, but when Sinead O'Connor was alive, no one cared, and he was all mad. But everyone yeah, well, cared. Well, Morrissey's mad all the time. But Morrissey's not the musician that we should be asking. No, there's guys. another musician that perhaps we should have asked more because he's no longer with us. But he tried. He tried real hard. Eric? Chuck Berry? He did try. Too hard. Oh, he might be alive. 
Chuck Berry might be alive. He might actually. be alive. Chuck Berry? Yeah. I don't know. King lock, of rock and roll. Lock your doors. Lock King of watching that poopoo. Watching yeah. that poo -poo slide. No, we're hitting it. We're getting there. We're getting there. Here it comes. Here it comes. I would kill all of you if this was Civ Sex Dream Chase. Whoa, what is this? Annie, are you okay? I swear to God, I saw this in Germany when I was a kid. Right. Man, his concerts. Stare him down. Speak with your eyes, not with Honestly, your Michael mouth, not with your fists. Yes. Speak with your heart, with your soul. Oh, I'm coming! I would have fucking freaked out. I would be like, ah! Oh, I wish I could be seven to show you my butthole. Bring out the little Albanian girl. He shoots her in the head. No. It's Kosovo. Chuck Berry died Guys, Kosovo. it's Kosovo. 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 Kosovo was the first Ukraine. Right? Slobodan Milosevic. It's like 96, 97. Slobodan Milosevic. Slobodan Milosevic. Milosevic. That's all he needed to do is have a flower. He is a flower. Like, yeah, sunflower. War is, solved. I actually war it, solved. It, it would hurt. <laughs> According to Annie Marcus, separate the art from the artist Parks. <laughs> but hey, <laughs> Michael Jackson fixed war, and we need to allow him to blow off some steam. <laughs> We've been talking about this about how he was just molesting those children to hold himself back because he was too good. Yeah. We're not going to do rehash this. I've been screamed at by many people at bars claiming his innocence, so I don't bring it up anymore. Interesting. A lot of people have a lot of opinions. What bars are you going yeah, to? Yeah, buddy, I'm telling you, it's not <laughs> art. It's not art. Are you going to? During, I will say this. There's a cultural difference in perception. Okay. We'll leave it at that. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. There, you've been yelled at. <laughs> <That laughs> I'm just I telling just... you. I, I know the you human know, race. There's different thoughts out there. He really does. He really, really, does. He really does. Because I made a joke one time, and then it was... People get upset. They got upset. And they got really upset. But I feel they got really was, upset. And you know why they got upset? Because Michael Jackson tried to end war. And we didn't and get mad at everybody. And, and, it's, people like, and, it. and it it's people like you. It's they people like profit. you. They it's, profit off of it. They're war profiteers. It's people That's like you. It's what people like show. you that didn't believe in him enough because he's like Tinkerbell. And kind if enough. enough people believed him in him and yes. clapped, then... He would have ended war. That honestly, was the test. No. I honestly, if a lot, if everybody saw that, if that, because you know a lot of people saw that concert. If they yes. just said, we need to show that to Joe Biden. Joe. We need to get a hold of fucking Joe Biden. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then maybe, just maybe, if we could stop war. Mm-hmm. He'll give me the use of my penis back. <laughs> yeah, that would be really fantastic. I think he needs it right now. Uh, you know, yes, indeed. Speaking of Joe Biden. Oh, great. I got a guy who's got a question. For Joe Biden. Ooh. Ooh, yeah. watch out there. So let's, let's, oh, I hope it's not challenging. Let's see if this man has the same question that you have, Henry. Let's check. Yeah, we'll see. Are my you question alive? to Joe Biden is, <laughs> why were you at my doctor's appointment? Greenway Clinic. What? Watching me. He can't hmm? move. In no, Utah. Be clear, clear, Jack. So he, All right, let me be clear. Your blood pressure's high, Jack. <laughs> If I walked into the doctor and I saw Joe Biden, I would actually feel kind of safe because you would know you're going to be getting good treatment. Yeah, yeah, you'd be like, well, yeah, we're here. You know, Joe Biden's here, mm -hmm. so at Can't least there's something. Bad. There might be, we might get something free. They are trying to keep him alive, unlike yeah. the most of American people, where they're actively trying to kill us because the cure is in the pain. See, the, the, mm -hmm. the reason the why I'm immediately like, what gets me scared is that I do, I get videos like this. Yeah. There are more people will just say weird ass shit, being right. like, "You're my dreams." Why are you following me in my dreams? Oh, yeah. And you're just like, bro, I, why did I open this? Yeah, I stopped opening things years ago. But you know, I'm curious. Yeah, I know you are. You're, dude, cur you're a curious, curious little kitty. That's I had true. the craziest. Jesse's asking here, is this the dude who ate the hornet's nest last week? It might be. I it mean, might be. it's possible. Because number one, he's eat yeah, he's eating wasp nests. He, I bet he's got a lot of questions for Joe Biden. I bet he has to go to the doctor. <laughs> I mean, yeah, he yeah. better be because he, he is. The his stomach's becoming a what's he, what do they call an insect jail? <laughs> a narborium? You know what I mean? <laughs> what crime did the insects make? What what was the insect? You crime? fucking hearing me? An in, <laughs> in insect jail. You fucking jail. hear what I'm saying? <laughs> an insect. What do you call an insect jail? You know where they put butterflies? Is this like a joke? No. 
I think it's a genuine the ask question. I know. Are you talking about the box that you used to put butterflies in when you were a kid? I did my it's soda a, press joke, I which is actually like a, a pun. science. Rob, could you type in insect jail? There's no insect up. jail. It does it. It's, it's just, just a it's butterfly cage. I think it's called a butterfly cage. I mean, it's the same butterfly name cage is, like is very simple. What, yeah, what is it about? So, just yeah, insect jail. What, is what insect comes jail? up? What is the, the, insect the, jail? The, Man eaten alive by it's bugs in a Georgia jail. jail. Okay, well, thank you, Henry. Yeah, that's really actually it's important for it's us to remember. That's wonderful. Garbage. Yeah. Oh, that was just a, from July wow. of this year. Wow, that happened. That was wow. That less was than a month ago. That twenty was, days. That less was, than twenty days ago. Ter yeah. Insectarium. In right, Gurney. <laughs> no, yeah, that's what they're saying. You tied it. Tears so the clown. Gurney, you tied it. She's not fucking working with Right now, she's Gurney. Right now, she's Gurney. She'll be tears when she's not. We don't know who tears are. I do we don't know who Tirzo is. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's not a mystery. It's a fucking character, you she don't. She broke character many times. It's because of how funny everyone is. Insectarium. And how fantastic. Insectarium, yes. It's the, it's the noun An insect plural. zoo. It's an insect zoo, which is also you could consider to be a joke. Uh, people a say, man, that uh, insectary. insectary. People insectary. say you don't learn shit from our oh, fucking garbage. Fuck you. Fuck your mother. Yeah. Sure. Fuck your fucking ass. Uh, insectarium. All right. Let's move on to the next video. Let's maybe this, my prog Henry, album. maybe this will calm me down. Because I know how I'm going to take your medication. I did forget to take my blood pressure medication last night. I should I should have done it today, but it makes me like tired during the day. But I'm trying to take it at you night. You got to take it at sure, night. You got to take it at night. Yeah. Are you sleep? Did you sleep? No, I mean I, I'm fine. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, okay. This is a this is going to be a video. The hives are called apiary. Thank you, Gurney. Okay, apiary. Yeah, we know apiaries. I know what an apiary is. I don't fucking know. This it. bees. That's what it, that's what the one was. This Can bees. But Henry, it's this not is not going to help you out in any life circumstance. This is going to calm you down, Henry, because this features a, a beloved character that I know you love so much. <laughs> okay. So beloved. It's OJ Simpson? Oh, it's Boss Baby! <laughs> Fuck that corporate! <laughs> Zaslov looking motherfucker! <laughs> also, Fuck it's you, too big, big money, baby! <laughs> you need to pay your employees, you fucking boss ass boss baby! baby. Goo Goo so Gaga, much. you need to hear it. You need to hear it in the language you can understand. Goo Goo Gaga, pay me my fucking money, boss baby. Yeah, I hate boss baby. Didn't they make like eight of those goddamn things? Yeah, it started baby. with look who's talking, but at least that baby was kind of fun. I actually, yeah. my Not problem the boss. With, no. The problem with boss baby is number one. When was he normal employee, baby? Never. I've never seen the movie. I never saw the movie. I've never it's, seen it's the, baby it is that. like the definition of nepotism, right? <laughs> is it just the <laughs> definition <laughs> of nepotism? <laughs> yeah, how did the baby get the job in the first place? They wrote it in a fucking script, and then the baby became the boss, and then they named it Boss Baby, Marcus. Oh, Clark actually says something interesting here. Do you know the Hundred Years' War took over? It's 116 years in three distinct periods. Wow, three distinct periods in Ben. Nate, no, we have not honored Pee Wee Herman today because we're not good enough comedians. Honestly, no, we're not. but yes, we love Pee Wee. It was extremely sad. Yeah, it was it's so a, sad. Yeah, it was a, it was a actually. But I'm glad, lesson, I'm glad you brought it up. It's Thanks a for bringing it up, Gurney. Thank you for putting it in the machine. Thanks, exactly, Gurney. Yeah. It is a lesson though for all of us. If you are dying of cancer, what have we learned from Norman? Scream Pee -wee? it from the top no, of the fucking. No, no, scream it. Keep it yourself. I will. You gonna. No, if I have a cold, <laughs> I am not a gentle. I'm not a brave man. No, I'm not, I am a, not a. I don't move in silence. You're, I'm just gonna be like, I'm sick. I was. Well, you better die then. Yeah. Because you know a lot of these Make a Wish kids that live, they've got to give back the footballs that were signed and. Do they? Nah. No. That would be fucking incredible. I would nothing <laughs> would better would cost me better yeah, yeah. than to be the repo the guy. Repo the man. repo the guy. The repo guy. He's got to fucking show up. So it looks like <laughs> you're doing pretty good there, pull, huh, Timmy? He's got he's to pull the sign. Aaron Hernandez. Oh, football. Yeah. Out of his hands. Like, yes, you're like, <laughs> Can you please, tonight when you go to the club, can you shoot? I killed two people, Mr. Benoit. I think I Thank you, you so much, Mr. Benoit. It's just so nice to meet you. I yeah, what do you want? Yeah, uh, I got palate cancer, Mr. Benoit. <laughs> could you all? Uh, hey, listen, just for yeah. me. Could you kill your family <laughs> using an exercise machine? Your wish is my command. <laughs> oh, Boss Baby killed someone on the set of Rust. Thank you, fancy. <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> that is absolutely fantastic. But you know, repo men usually come around when no one's home. I would. They're weak. Speaking of Repo Man, that's a pro wrestler. Have you seen I don't even want to hear about that. I don't want you to talk shit about Repo Man because you no. know for a fact they are vengeance seekers. Yes, yes. they probably yeah. listen to the show. Well, they're just We doing definitely their job. have Repo they're guys. They're doing their job. Yeah, yeah, we have Repo guys that do that. It's a hard job. Actually, this brings us to a, a very uh, interesting time in the show because I happen to have a video featuring one of the stars.
of Repo Man. Oh shit! I movie. love Repo Man. Oh yeah. Oh, is this a Harry Dean Stanton? Is that Harry a... Dean Stanton? Yay! And I want and I want you guys to listen to this. I want you to no comments. I love until the, the end. Okay, I love I, it. So I want this you, is a movie. No, oh, this no. is this is an interview. There's some words of wisdom here. Oh, is this it's the one a, with him and David Lynch? Yes, it is. Yes. Oh. It's That's, good, Kissel. You'll like this. You'll, you'll actually, you'll love this. How would you describe yourself? There's nothing. There's no self. <laughs> <laughs> and how would you like to be remembered? Doesn't matter. What were your dreams as a child? Uh, nightmares. <laughs> I Seems about him. right. I love I that I love video. him. I, also, I just love that they are both in on a cosmic joke that no one understands. Like, yeah. David they Lynch, they talked about how when he made Blue Velvet, that he thought he, he it's a comedy to him. Yeah. He thought it was a comedy. And originally, they had put helium in a tank. And so when he would... Um, Dennis uh, Hopper. When Dennis Hopper would suck on the helium, he'd start going like, Baby, what's the fuck? <laughs> Baby, what's the fuck? And then apparently he would st he would ruin takes laughing. Like, he would do all this stuff. <laughs> and he was doing that horrible rape scene where he's like, he's putting them, the blue velvet in her mouth, and he's sucking going, Baby, what's the fuck? And he's just like, loving it. Think it's the funniest thing in the world. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. Well, yeah. Mr. Lynch, certainly an icon in his craft. Sorry for your Dune heads out there, though. They should have given him final say. No, well, and he said that Dune movie, the, the OG, he yeah, disavows it. Better. He won't even write about well, it because in his book. he said he wow. said they ruined it for him. Well, he he, I feel that he was also disappointed in his performance. Uh, it was too big and it wasn't the right thing because he was up also for Star Wars. He was supposed to do uh, Return of the Jedi. Yeah, he was like on a short list. Holy and yeah! So they that would have been do... that would have changed Can you history. Imagine? It yeah. would have been it would have been different. It would have been cool. Um, I'd watch the shit out of Make a Wish Repo, according to KS. Um, right. Oh yeah, Big Herb. I love the No Dogs in Space story of him getting hammered with the replacements on SNL. Yeah, yeah, yeah is yeah. that real? Yeah, that's absolutely real. Uh, Harry Dean Stanton was when the replacements played, and actually are one of the very few people to be banned from SNL. Uh, Harry Dean Stanton? No, no, no. The replacements. Oh, really? Yeah. They got uh, banned because there's a, a whole host of reasons. I should that. listen to the episode. Yeah, this yeah, is they, where you plug. Yeah, yeah. They uh, absolutely, yeah. They listen to the episode for do? the full story. Just a little bit. Uh, they uh, completely trashed the green room uh, and Bob Stinson showed his ass uh, on screen. Rock and, and roll. And, um, it is pure rock and roll. Yeah. And Paul Westerberg said fuck uh, on, live on air. Lauren during Michaels the song. does not like that. He, he does really upset. Some yeah. of my favorite uh, stories that I read growing up were about Chris Farley taking dumps out, uh, out the window, mm -hmm. right up to the sidewalk mm -hmm. from like 30 floors. I People used to be crazy on this. Well, oh, yeah. the, well, the replacements How'd they were, get them banned? Well, the replacements were famously like big drunks and they showed up at like noon Drunk. for sound check, check that day. They were sober for sound check, but then of course they're stuck in a green Just room. Partying. All Just partying. Oh, they're, they're stuck in a green room until midnight. Yeah. You know what? If um, I'm Lauren Michaels, you say today we're going to do a thing called pre record. He is a he's notorious for that though. Yeah. He's notorious for putting people like straight up just like shouldn't be on the show. Yeah. And then like you see we have some differences here. And then like yeah. you know like oh no he uh, lost his shit at them oh, yeah. at the after party and just uh, completely balled them out. But before the show, Harry Dean Stanton went into their room and they had a big bottle of whiskey and Harry Dean he just fucking chugged it down and went out and did his monologue and the rest of the show drunk. I love him! Yeah. I love Harry Dean Stanton. He's wonderful. Moon Bastard, this is very interesting. I was in a Darwinism class with Isabella Rossellini. She was studying from some weirdo YouTube series on animal sex. Who is Isabella Rossellini? She, she blue, was Blue uh, Velvet. She was Blue, blue Velvet, Velvet and she was also, uh, I think she was with David Lynch for a long period of time. I think maybe. Oh. Might have been together. Yeah, Alright. Alright, well let's see. We got one more video let's and this see. one's sure to cause a lot of conversation that's definitely going to take Well, we also have to get to, to the, the final end. polling results. Yeah, we got to guarantee get you. Again, we need to fix results. this vote. Please All right. God, vote the right but way. But I know this, your heart. this video that I got now, I mean, this is going to be a, a genuine conversation. Actually, so I think, for I think what people video should, you would rather have a beer with? I think people should stop voting with their heart, start <laughs> voting with their pussy. Sure, yeah. whatever. Yeah. Whatever means. I mean, I like it. The cutie. <laughs> That's cute. Uh, discuss. Well, I mean, I think it was very good. I think it shows you what can happen between two peppers, red pepper, green Whoa. pepper. They come together, kind of mesh, and then there's an alligator. That YouTube series rocks. She dresses up like animal genitals and tells you how they fuck.
You know, I've seen that. That's wild. I didn't know that. That was real. Yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. Well, well how does she dress up like animal, animals' genitals? Well, we saw, we've seen a dog pussy before. No, how do you like dress it? up like it, though? Ingenuity. How do you? I would imagine Hollywood you just magic. kind of make a large uh, representation of it and just cut out a head hole. It's called green porno? Yeah. Hold on. Let's see a little bit of this then. We'll discuss the video more, but. Yeah, I definitely remember this. <laughs> I watched that Pee Wee Herman episode that he was in Aww. when he played the the air when he's the yeah. when he has the ivory hand. Yeah, that is very it's very very funny. Pee Wee's the man. Yeah, I might watch Pee Wee's Big Adventure tonight. So she was in Friends as Ross's celebrity hall pass Kissel. Wow, you know I don't that? know. I, no, wow. I should. I honestly, I really should. I I know. Uh, I just can't. It's I so feel, sad, I man. I got was... to see him. I will oh. say, I'm very happy that I got to see him twice. I saw him on Broadway when they redid the show oh. on Broadway. That was fucking awesome. Oh, that's. And then fun. we saw him uh, do his right before quarantine, like literally a week before quarantine. We got to see him in L.A. Show Big Adventure live. Talk all about oh, that it. That would have been awesome. He was really great. He was apparently a really. I know people who knew him. They said he was just fucking exactly. You know, strange man. Yeah, but I funny as so. all hell. And I don't want him. Kind. To, if if I walked in and I met him and he was just like, hey, yes. well, I'm actually a Mormon. Uh, it's nah. My friend Mitt, Mitt Romney. I'd be like, no, you want? I, he needs to be strange. I want him to be strange. Yeah. He's Pee Wee. Long time fan. First time watching the stream live. High as fuck. Recovering from surgery. Thank y'all for popping my cherry so gently. That reminds me of that band, That's Cherry like Poppin' Dead. I seem to lose, I've lost more since the uh, votes have continued. No, yeah. this is called, this is why you wait. Yeah. This is well, why I you have to wait till the votes come 72. in. 72. Well, nothing's really changed here. Huh? 67. No. Well over I think 50. we got, yeah, I think well we got over. more for video one and more for video because two. Because the number Three. one, video again, Three, actually. Yeah. is just beast. Yeah, and right. it's just bees, but some it's people don't like. Some it. people don't seem to be really taking the point that it, it's about that person, no. how happy that person was. When Isabella the Rossellini is Ingrid Bergman's daughter. Interesting. Well, how, how'd she ever make it in Hollywood? Oh, right. she's beautiful. Yeah. She's beautiful. She's very talented. I know it's she's not wonderful. that easy. Um, and come back to your video. I'm glad that those little girls are doing that, and they weren't thrown off a cliff. <laughs> True. <laughs> they I, are, are. Do they do you that? Know what I'm do? Is, that, is, that is that an antiquated thought? No. That you're happy that the little girls weren't thrown off a cliff? But no, <laughs> no, 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 no not that. That's new for me. That's new for you. I'm saying like the idea of the uh, like the little girls, or they like, rather they don't have as many girls. Mm -hmm. They don't trip. They don't kill them, right? No. Well, China had a one child policy for a for a while. Time, we were only allowed to have it, but, yeah, but it, I don't think and they then most of the time they wanted they... the boys. But I think girls yeah, are on the other. Yeah, they were looking for boys. Yeah, but I don't think they killed them. But they didn't like ship them yeah. away. No, it turns out now all the boys are really lonely, and that's why they're banging all these robots. Yeah, because there's no girls. Yeah. You know what's nice about a robot? You shut it off. I actually, I was just reading an article on how sex dolls are going to be able to record you and probably use it for blackmail. Oh yeah, that's incredible. They can also be hacked very easily. I wow. just can't wait yeah. to gift people them. Yeah, you know what I mean. Because that's going to be really fun. I can't you know? wait. There's going to be election at some point where we're going to have sex doll footage of one of our politicians. I can't wait. This is my Philip K. Dick world. This yeah. is my William Gibson Ugh. Philip K. Dick world. I don't mind it. You got to keep your head on a swivel. Don't trust your toaster. Fucking, you don't ever know what's gonna happen. You're gonna have to pay money to use the refrigerator soon. That's really fucked up, actually. And LG is doing that recently, and we are an LG family. We're not gonna be one anymore. Wow. So they're 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 making you do a subscription. They're starting to, to float this concept of like, what if you also had? What if your stove was a subscription model? Have fun. It ain't happening. It's like they're not. It's not, not happening. House. It's not gonna happen. Everyone's gonna rip out that mechanism. As yeah. far as I'm concerned, that has to be a way that you could like a stove is still just a gas and a burner, whatever it is. I'm just gonna rip out that fucking mechanism and then yeah. just just make it a normal ass stove. Yeah. But you probably won't get it to blow you, and you probably won't be able to set the Bluetooth thing so you can play your favorite Shakira song when you're making chicken. Yeah, like all that type of shit. Yeah, yeah. you like, like sorry, I just want a stove. You have been drenched in the idiocy of Hollywood, but yet you hold on to your strong moral freedom loving foundation. I'm still. White trash. If there's anything that this show is known for, it's moral fiber. Moral fiber. <laughs> Thank you so much, everybody. Wow. Bye. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> uh. I guarantee you're going to look for that video. Have a great you're gonna night. You're going to want Bye. it. Hail yourself. Bye. Spaghetti. Yeah.